The Defense Research and Development Organization, or DRDO of India, has initiated the development of advanced jam-proof technology for Indian fighter jets, a significant milestone for India's aerospace and defense sector. This move towards jam-proof flight systems addresses one of modern aerial warfare's greatest threats, electronic jamming and denial tactics, which can disrupt or completely sever a fighter's ability to communicate, navigate, and retaliate in hostile, contested environments. Jam-proof flight technology, as currently envisioned by DRDO, revolves around creating fighter jets whose control and communication systems are highly resistant, or even immune, to deliberate enemy attempts to interfere with, disable, or jam them through electromagnetic or cyber means. The latest project, the Jam-Tolerant Geared Rotary Actuator, will allow an aircraft to remain fully controllable even when exposed to severe hostile jamming attempts. This technology uses a mix of hardened, encrypted, and redundant control channels, often leveraging indigenous navigation satellites, robust data links, and advanced signal processing systems. Jamming is, you know, a core component of modern electronic warfare, where adversaries use powerful electromagnetic signals to interfere with enemy radars, communications, and navigational aids. Such attacks can disrupt pilot-to-base and fighter-to-fighter communications. Jamming can blind or mislead an aircraft's radar and sensors. It can also jam satellite-based navigation and weapon guidance systems. This might, uh, cause loss of control or situational awareness, especially in contested airspaces. Mitigating peer adversaries is crucial. With both China and Pakistan investing heavily in electronic warfare and anti-access or area denial strategies, India needs robust electronic counter-countermeasures to keep its air operations credible and effective in any future conflict. Jam-proof flight systems ensure Indian fighter jets can operate, communicate, and execute missions deep into contested or denied airspace without being rendered blind or mute by enemy action. Even if enemy forces try to jam aircraft controls, mission data links, or navigation aids, Indian jets can continue, potentially tipping the balance of a critical engagement. Success can position India as a global supplier of advanced aviation electronic warfare technology for friendly or partner air forces. During hostile penetration or strikes, Indian jets can fly into heavily contested airspace like those so-called anti-access bubbles created by advanced adversaries, with confidence, knowing that enemy jammers just can't neutralize them. Networked combat means that jam-proof data links allow for real-time sharing of targeting, navigation, and threat data between multiple platforms, such as fighters, AWACS, and ground forces. This, in turn, supports swarming tactics and collaborative combat, making the entire force much more effective. Counter-electronic warfare means having the ability to, you know, fight through enemy jamming or even locate and target enemy electronic warfare assets. DRDO's Jam Tolerant Flight Actuator Project is set for completion in 36 months with 90% government funding, a reflection of the high priority placed on survivability and operational integrity for Indian jets. Once proven and inducted, these systems will likely become standard for the AMCA, LCA Tejas Mark II, and major upgrades of the Su-30 MKI, Rafale, and imported platforms. Thank you for watching. If you found the video insightful, hit the like button and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.